welcome back to the Crafty Pie YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Brogan. I make videos about sewing, fashion, all things crafty, and today I'm officially coming to you with the first Christmas themed video this year. I am so excited to film this video for you guys. A lot of preparation has gone into it. This year I really wanted to do my ultimate Crafty Pie Christmas gift guide to give you some ideas for your own Christmas list or to give you ideas for the other sewers and crafters in your life. But I've tried to round up all of my favorite gift ideas and bring them to you today and hopefully it gives you some Christmas inspo. I have split all of the gifts into three different categories just to make sure there's a price point for everyone. So the first category is kind of like the stocking fillers, everything is £25 and under. Then we've got the sort of like middle category which is between £25 and £60. And then we've got our splurges category to finish off with. So that is £60 and upwards. The perfect thing for if the hubby's promised you a really impressive gift this year year so I hope there's something for everyone and we are going to go in ascending order so we will start with the cheapest and then work our way up. Thanks to all the amazing brands that I work with I do have the majority of the gifts actually here to show you most of them have been sent over just for this video which is amazing there is going to be a little giveaway in here as well so stay tuned for that and anything that I don't have here, I will just include pictures of. So without further ado, let's get into all these amazing Christmas gifts. Starting with our stocking filler category, which is £25 and under, the most affordable gift I have this year is this super cute little stitch marker set by Millward. So these are stitch markers for knitting and crochet. I know a lot of you guys enjoy knitting and crochet as well and I just thought this was a super cute small gift. Maybe if you're doing a really cheap secret Santa or you want something for stocking. This is so nice. So it comes in a really lovely little plastic case and then you've got 10 different coloured stitch markers. They've all got their own little section and I just think they're super cute. I have never had stitch markers before and I think it's something that a lot of people kind of like are missing in their stash. So this would be a great option. For gift number two, and I absolutely love this one. You guys might have seen me use my yarn mug loads before. I should have it here to show you. Wait, let me go grab it. Okay, that was a fail because it's in the dishwasher. Um, but my yarn mug basically just looks like a giant ball of wool. I absolutely love it. And I found a different one this year. So this one is kind of like a scissor design. Let me open it. So this is the mug. It is so cute. The handle are these little scissors so you can just hold it like that. I think most sewers and crafters enjoy a lovely hot drink whilst they sew. So actually I think this is the perfect gift. It is $11.95 so it's really affordable. I got my mug two years ago for Christmas and I still use it most days, hence why it's in the dishwasher. So I can confirm that they last really well and I just think this is so cute. Next up, we have the Liberty Vintage Sewing Machine Christmas Decoration. I'll pop a picture here to show you. I love this. I was in London a few weeks ago and Liberty did have all their Christmas things out. I hunted everywhere and I could not find this decoration annoyingly so I think I might have to get it online. It is £18.95 which let's be real is quite expensive for Christmas decoration but I think it's super special and I think any sewer would absolutely love this on their tree. Next we have something for the crocheters and it is this gorgeous soft grip crochet hook set from Millwards. I'm a huge fan of the Millward brand in general. They have such a great range of products and this is no exception. So it's essentially a kit of nine crochet hooks. It goes from two millimeters to six millimeters. And I just think if you have someone that is really into crochet, this is the perfect gift because it means they have the full set and also they are really handy because they are soft grip, so they look really comfortable. Believe it or not, I cannot crochet. I've always wanted to. My sister is amazing at it, and it makes me jealous whenever I see what she's made. So maybe I'll use this to teach myself. Who knows? This set comes in at £18.95, which I think is a really, really good price point for something like this. 
and it would look super cute wrapped up in a little stocking. Back to something for the sores. You guys might have seen on my Instagram that for the past few months I have been working with a French pattern company called Maison Fauve. I truly am their biggest fan and I'm so pleased that I've had the opportunity to work with them. And their patterns are stunning. So I wanted to pick one that I think would make an amazing gift. So I picked the Metropolis jacket. I picked this up at the Knitting and Stitching show. And first of all, why I think this would make an amazing gift is one, the packaging. So what stands Maison Fauve out from the rest is just how gorgeous the packaging always is. The pattern packet is really made to last. It's gold foiled. All of the like designs are so pretty. And this pattern in particular, I think would be the kind of pattern that any sewer would love is the typical Chanel style jacket that would look amazing sewn up in like a boucle or a tweed or a wool for winter and I just think it's so classic and chic and I love that it's kind of like a French silhouette from a French pattern company. This pattern comes in at £19.90 which is I guess slightly on the pricier range for a printed pattern but I think it's clear to see why when you see how beautiful it is in real life. I think this would make such a special gift really thoughtful for someone that you know enjoys sewing and honestly I could recommend any of their patterns but I think this one would be a gorgeous option for Christmas. Next up we have the perfect gift for the sewer that literally has everything. So this is the Generates Silicone Hemmer. This is actually produced by Jen Hogg who was on the Sewing Bee herself so she's a fellow Sewing Bee alumni. I had the pleasure of meeting her at what show was it? Festival of Quilts and I purchased this from her there and I just think this is such a great tool for any sewer. So essentially it has different lines of perforations on it so it goes from like 0.5 centimetres um, all the way to three centimetres. You essentially place this on top of your fabric that you want to hem and you fold over the bottom of the fabric so it lines up with the gauges. You've got a curved line and a straight line depending on what hem you want to do and obviously because it's silicone it's not going to burn and it's fine to be used with heat. This is £20 which I know could seem maybe slightly expensive for you know a tiny piece of silicone but I think the thought that's gone into this really makes it worth the price. It's from a small business obviously so you're going to be supporting Jen with her business and I just think the fact that she is a sewer and she's made this you can really tell she's thought about what a sewer would need and I think this is just a really really great tool that you would be reaching for all the time. Another gift that I picked out that would be amazing for both a really beginner sewer to a more advanced one is this book. So I love going into shops and looking at sewing books. I think they are such a good tool. They're really great value because most of the time you get, you know, multiple patterns for the price that you might pay for one or two normally. So this year I picked the Sew Your Own Scandi wardrobe book. Now this is a fairly recent release. I was actually sent this alongside the release and I'm so glad that they reached out because it is a really gorgeous book. So obviously it kind of has that Scandinavian feel and it's essentially everything you need to sew your own wardrobe. So the patterns are really varied. If I read you some of the projects that are in here, a t-shirt, a blazer, a coat, wrap skirt, trousers, cocktail dress, swimsuit, beret, bag. Um, there really is something for everyone and I also think all of the photography is just gorgeous. So again, this would be lovely to get someone that you know is really keen or maybe it's just starting out sewing their own wardrobe and want some really staple patterns. This does say that it's £25 on the back of the book but I did have a little look on Amazon and you can get it for about £17 at the minute so definitely have a look on there. Okay, the next stocking filler idea is something that I absolutely could not live without and it is the Millward Extra Sharp Dressmaking Scissors. I was gifted some of these probably over a year ago now and they are without doubt my favourite scissors ever. A bold claim I know but they really are super sharp and just the way that they glide through the fabric is unlike any other scissors I've used. 
I genuinely have about six pairs of scissors hanging up <laughs> in my sewing room and every time without fail I reach for these ones. They come in a gorgeous little presentation box as well so I think wrapped up this would make a really lovely gift and they are £23.95. I don't know a single sewer that wouldn't appreciate a gorgeous pair of scissors for Christmas. So definitely check these out if you're in the market for some or if you're wanting to gift some. Carrying on, it is time to talk stationery and sewing planning. I am a stationery addict. I love notebooks, pens. I used to be really into like doing my planner, but since I had my son, I just don't really have the time. But I spotted these absolutely gorgeous pieces of rifle paper co stationery and I knew it would be the absolute perfect Christmas gift. So they're kind of at two different price points but the first is this set of three stunning notebooks. They are gold foiled and embossed. They've got a really lovely natural print on them. They've got the gorgeous stitched spine which just gives it that kind of like handmade sewing feel and they're all lined pages so they're perfect for making notes, planning your projects, anything really but I absolutely love these and these are $14.95 which I think is super affordable and again a really lovely gift. And then the other option I have from Rifle Paper Co is the 2024 monthly and weekly planner. I definitely need to get better at planning going into 2024. I have lists everywhere and I really want to start actually writing it all down in the same place. I love this one because it has the standard like a weekly space to write down. You've also got your month overview and obviously it's gorgeous so what isn't there to love? Both of these stationery pieces can be found on the Alice Caroline Fabrics website. I love Alice Caroline and all of her products. She does the most amazing Liberty fabric fabrics but what you might know is that she has an amazing gifting section as well and I was so excited to find these on there so as I mentioned these are $14.95 so they're a bit more affordable and this one is $24.95 so it still comes in under the stocking filler price point and I just think these would make such gorgeous gifts. We are on to our very last stocking filler and this is another one from the Alice Caroline Fabrics website. Now I don't know about you guys but I am Liberty obsessed, I'm pretty sure a lot of sewers are but sometimes it's nice to actually have something made for you if that makes sense. So I did pick out this absolutely gorgeous cosmetic pouch. So Alice Caroline actually has loads of ready made Liberty products as well which is absolutely amazing and I just absolutely fell in love with this little makeup pouch. So it is in the emerald green Liberty Tanalon. It is so soft. If you felt Liberty Tanalon before, you know the quality is insane. It's quilted, so it's really nice and thick. And then it's got this stunning pink lining. But actually, they have so many of the different Liberty fabric designs in all of their products. They've got their cosmetic bags, they've got larger wash bags, but I thought this was a really, really lovely option. It is $24.95 and I just think it's super gorgeous and also very festive in this green color. You wouldn't even have to use it as a makeup bag either. I did think it could be nice to store all of your sewing labels in or maybe all your elastics. It could definitely have a place in a sewing room. So that would be a super cute idea if you're slightly unsure what to get someone who has a lot of sewing stuff already. Now we are going to move on to our next price point, which is anything more expensive than those £25 stocking fillers, but under £60. So this could be a gorgeous gift wrapped under your tree. These are great things to write on your own Christmas list. So let's get into it. Gift idea number one is the Trim It 12 Days of Christmas Felt Advent Kit. So I will pop a picture here because this was actually a really recent find that I didn't have time to get in for the video. But you guys know if you've been following along on my Instagram story that I've been working on a handmade advent calendar for baby boy this year. I've been sewing loads of little felt characters. It has been such a fun project to do. I was a bit unsure whether to do it because I knew it would be quite time consuming, but I've enjoyed stitching these by hand at night so much. And I did have a lot of you chatting to me in my DMs and saying that you would love to have a go at something similar. So I think this kit would be absolutely perfect 
You could use it as a bit of an advent calendar if you wanted to. So like every couple of days, you could be working on making a little decoration. It could go towards an advent calendar. You could use them on the tree. I personally have experience with the Trimits embroidery kits and I just absolutely love the quality of all of the tools that are included. You get absolutely everything. So bar like the scissors, you wouldn't need to add anything to your project. It is £27. So again, nice and affordable if you wanted to get someone a slightly bigger gift, but also it'd be amazing for your own Christmas list or even just to treat yourself if you're fancy doing a Christmas craft over December. Okay, moving on, one of my favourite things to do is to get an advent calendar for Christmas. Now, this might sound odd, but January can be slightly boring. So imagine opening an advent calendar in January. I've done it before. My mum tends to get me like a beauty advent calendar and she gives it to me on Christmas day and I love opening it throughout January. So I have got a few advent calendars I wanted to mention in this video. Obviously you could get it for yourself in time for December, but if you're wanting to add it to your Christmas list, you could just do it in January instead. So I do have the Hemline Advent Calendar here. What I like about this is it feels really special. Obviously the box is gorgeous. You do have 24 different doors to open, but also it's really nice and affordable. I will say that the price varies quite a lot when you look online, depending on like where it has an offer on, but 29.99 is sort of like the ballpark figure. And I just think this is a really gorgeous option, especially if you're maybe newer to sewing and you need a lot of basics. I don't wanna to give too many spoilers, but it does tell you things that are on the back. So you do get some really good threads in there. You get things like a magnet, a pin cushion. So these might be items that a more um, advanced sewer would have already. But if you're newer to sewing or you're just looking for something fun to open throughout December, I think this would be a great pick. Next up, we have an amazing idea for someone who might have their own sewing room or is super into their dressmaking. And it is the 120 reel thread holder from Millward. You can get these wooden Millward thread holders in all kinds of sizes. They do it from like mini to really, really big. But the 120, I'm pretty sure, is the biggest one they have available. I have mine sat behind me with all of my Gutterman threads on and I am absolutely obsessed with it. It does kind of upset me now though that I do have quite a lot of gaps. I need to like rebuy a lot of my thread colours. But I absolutely love it. It's such a special thing to have. It looks amazing in a sewing room. And I think if you've got someone in your life that has their own little sewing space, or maybe is planning on getting one this would make an incredible gift I think actually for this gift it's an amazing price point again it does vary where you look but they're around £30 which I think is great for such one a big gift and to something that you would use so much and you do have the option to get the smaller reels I think the smallest one that I have is about 25 I've got all my pin board over there so it's a 25 reel holder and I think you can pick them up for about 10 pounds so they are some great ideas for gifts next up we have another gift idea from a lovely small business called sheepers I was actually gifted this set a few weeks ago and I couldn't not include it in the gift guide because I honestly think this would make the most perfect present for someone. This is the Sheepers Slip Kit and essentially you get everything you need to make your own sheepskin slippers. So if I just pull out some of the bits that are included, you get the base of the slipper, which obviously is sheepskin and is so soft, you have to choose your correct size for the sole. So obviously you would need to know that about the person you're getting the gift for. And then you also get the sheepskin main slipper. So mine is in black and obviously it's super soft on the outside. And then you also get this amazing sheepskin trim that's gonna go around the top of the slipper. And then obviously you trim this down as desired. Obviously they include other things like your threads and the wool because there is an option to do a bit of embroidery on the front so that's great. 
and also they have a huge range of colors so it is really customizable when you go on the website you get to choose your sheepskin color and the fur trim around the outside so you really can tailor it to whoever you're giving the gift to or just be really really specific on your Christmas list. <laughs> this comes in at £30 which I think is so good for a full craft kit and also the fact that you get such high quality supplies in size. I honestly think that is a bargain. Now I did want to mention that also sheepers make and sell the slippers too so if you were after something that is for someone who loves to be cosy but doesn't necessarily sew for £40 you can actually just buy the slippers already made. So there's two options there whether you want to get crafty and do it yourself or have something made for you. It wouldn't be a Crafty Pie gift guide if I didn't talk about at least one piece of jewellery because I'm a huge jewellery lover and I decided to include this Tati Devine sewing machine necklace. Tati Devine does amazing designs, they're super fun and obviously why wouldn't a sewer want this necklace? I think it's so cute. It is £38 which again for a really nice piece of jewellery I don't think is too bad and also what I wanted to mention about this is it's made out of recycled acrylic and other materials so it is actually a lovely sustainable option. I know it's quite a common theme in the sewing community to really prioritise sustainability. Obviously making your own clothes has a lovely sustainable aspect. So if you were looking for something from a bit more of a sustainable brand, then I think this necklace could be a really good go-to. They have loads of other fun designs on the website, so definitely check them out. They kind of vary in price. Some of them can be a bit more expensive, but I think for £38, this necklace could be a really, really lovely gift. Next we have something to bring a little bit of sunshine to your sewing room and it is this absolutely gorgeous rainbow sewing box. I always remember Annie having one of these on my series of the sewing bee and as soon as I saw it I was so jealous because I thought it was so cute and I managed to find it. So I will obviously have the links for everything down below but this sewing box comes in at $39.50 I believe and this is such a fun gift. I definitely think this is something to put on your Christmas list if you don't have a sewing box yet. Um, so obviously you have the gorgeous handles and then you just lift up the lid and it does have a nice little compartment in there that you can store like threads and pins and things. Little pockets in the side and then you can also take out that little tray and you've got loads of space underneath. So if you are someone who likes to go to craft classes or take your sewing supplies with you anywhere, this is a really, really lovely product that I think you would get a lot of use out of. And I honestly don't think I can look at this without smiling because it's so bright and cheerful. The very last gift I wanted to talk to you about for our kind of like middle of the road price point gifts is the Fabric Godmother subscription box. It is called their Dream Wardrobe box. I have had the pleasure of sewing up a month before. It was my Bianca flight suit. I got this in the Dream Wardrobe box. And honestly, I think I needed to subscribe. The box is £59 a month. So obviously, it's kind of a tricky one because you might buy it for someone as a one-off or long term therefore it's going to work out a lot more expensive but I thought I would still include it in this one. There are a few other sewing boxes on the market but what makes this one stand out from the rest is just how trendy and chic Josie's picks always are. First of all I'm obsessed with all Fabric Godmother fabrics. They do have their own range but Josie just picks the most incredible fabrics to stock in her shop. And also the patterns that she picks a lot of the time are a bit more obscure, like I might not have heard of them, but as soon as I see them, I want to sew them up. So in the box, you do get a printed pattern, enough fabric to make said pattern, you get threads, and then I think there's another sewing related gift in there as well. And I'm pretty sure that I read on the website that if you already have the pattern, you can trade it in for something else, which I think is really lovely because obviously you don't really want duplicates of something. But I would say that if you are in the market for a sewing subscription box, I 100% would pick this one if I was gonna be spending my own money on it. I think it would make a really really special gift and maybe you could even just treat yourself to it. Now it is time to talk about those sewing splurges. Maybe you have Christmas money that you want to spend on yourself 
or the hubby has promised you a really great gift this year. I have a few ideas for you, so let's chat about it. First gift is in this gorgeous little packet from Alice Caroline Fabrics. Side note, her stuff always comes wrapped so nicely, so if you are buying it as a gift for someone else, you know that it's gonna come and look really, really cute already. But I decided to pick one of her Liberty bundles to show you guys. This is the bundle of 13 Betsy Fat Quarters, obviously in the Liberty Tan Alone. If you are new to Liberty and you're wanting to try out a few of their designs, or you're just a fanatic and you absolutely need to improve your stash, this is what you want to put on your Christmas list. It is £92.95, but you get 13 different Liberty Fat Quarters and they're in just the most stunning Betsy designs. One of them that really stands out to me is this gorgeous kind of like fuchsia pink one and then some of them are also the Betsy Anne design which essentially is Betsy just smaller. Obviously Liberty can be quite pricey and sometimes because they have a load of designs to choose from I can find it a bit overwhelming to actually pick what to spend my money on and invest in. So something like this is great because you can actually see and feel all the fabrics in real life. You can have a go at sewing some smaller projects like cosmetic bags or you just um, patchwork to do a big ruffle bag. I do have a tutorial for that on my YouTube as well. And then you can see what fabrics you're really drawn to out of those projects and then potentially invest in more meterage for like a dressmaking project. So I did have in mind that as part of my gift guide, I would want to do a giveaway for you guys just to spread some Christmas cheer and to say thank you for all the love and support you've given me this year. Um, it really does mean the world and obviously you guys engaging and watching and liking my content means that I get to do this as a job, which is just incredible. So I am actually gonna give away this bundle of Betsy um, and hopefully it brings some Christmas joy to one of you. So we're gonna keep it nice and simple. You do need to be subscribed to me here on YouTube and then also following me over on Instagram. If you like this video and then comment your Instagram handle underneath and that's it and then I will announce the winners of the giveaway on my Instagram story and it means that I'll be able to tag you so make sure that you leave your Instagram handle and just subscribe on here follow me on there and like this video and then I will pick some winners for that I'll probably leave the giveaway open for a week but all of the specific giveaway instructions and terms and conditions will be in the description box below. So make sure you leave a little comment and I'll be sending one of you this gorgeous little bundle. Next up for the splurges is a gift for the sewer that has everything apart from this. And it is the Simplicity Bias Tape Maker. This is such a cool little gadget. It essentially makes bias binding for you in different widths and sizes. It presses it all, it rolls it up, it really does do a little bit of everything. So this comes in at £115. So I think this is one of those tools that you probably wouldn't purchase for yourself just randomly. But if you're looking for a Christmas gift that's a little bit out of the norm of what you'd usually be buying, then this would be perfect. I don't know about you guys, but I absolutely hate making bias binding, like hand pressing all the edges. I think it can be really difficult to get it completely even. That's why I tend to reach for ready-made a lot. But for those projects that you want to have your own matching binding, then this is such a good tool to have. I've also seen so many people making bias binding out of their scraps of Liberty fabric. Obviously you don't wanna be wasting that. So something like this machine would help you make the perfect binding. It gives you all the different attachments to choose what width you want. And I've used this a couple of times and I found it really user friendly. It didn't take me a long time to set up and I also got the hang of it really quickly. So I would definitely recommend this little gadget here. Next, we have another advent calendar that comes in at a slightly higher price point, And this is the Fabric Godmother advent calendar. I am so excited to get to open this on December the 1st. This, I'm pretty sure, is the first year that the Fabric Godmother team has done an advent calendar. And I know without a doubt there's going to be some amazing gifts in here because, as I mentioned before, Josie and her team have the best taste. 
So this advent calendar is priced at £120. So if you take off the lids, you will see that you have lots of different boxes to pull out and open. And I just love the design. I'm actually going to sew up a dress in this exact Fabric Godmother fabric later today, which I just think is so cute that my dress is going to match my advent calendar. Something else that I absolutely love about this calendar is there has been no spoilers on the internet whatsoever. No one has done an unboxing. There is not a video where you can go and watch someone open it all, which I think is great because it genuinely is a complete surprise and we're all going to be able to enjoy opening it on the 1st of December. Although I will say that pulling out box number one, it does smell really good. I don't know if it just, the calendar in general smells really good. No. I'm pretty sure it's box number one, so I'm secretly hoping that's a hand cream in there. Obviously, this is quite a bit more expensive for an advent calendar. When the box arrived, I did think that it looks quite small, but I 100% trust that Josie and her team will have picked out some great gifts. So I'm really, really excited to open this. So if you are wanting to treat yourself, or maybe, as I said before, wait until January, this would be a really good pick. The next splurge on my list is something that I well and truly have used and loved for over a year now and it is the Aliso Smart Iron. Now I've had a few comments on my videos over on Instagram asking me if this little baby is worth £149 and I can wholeheartedly say yes. So if you're not familiar with the Smart Iron, one of the main things that it does is it auto lifts. So rather than a regular iron which you would sit up like this, the iron is designed to sit flat um, all the time and then when you put your hand on it and you go to reach to use it, it lowers down the hot plate and then when you let go and you finish ironing it lifts up and therefore you're not going to burn your table. That is what everyone thinks of when they think of this iron but it has so many other features that I don't think people are aware of. So it has this dial right on the front that you can choose the kind of fabric that you're using and then it changes the heat. So you've got wool and silk, linen and cotton, you have a really good steam setting that you can change as well and you have a button that you can press to actually steam your garment. Now I find that so useful particularly when I'm doing shearing because I really need to be able to steam all of the elastic and when you press this button it really gives you a good burst of steam. The other thing that I would say that I love about this iron, obviously I've used it for over a year now, every other iron that I've used has got really clogged with like, um, what do you even call it, like kind of lime scale and previously when I would try and steam things I would always get like just weird stuff coming out my iron and ruining my fabric. I've never once had any issues with this iron excreting strange things or getting clogged or the steam not working. It literally still looks pristine on the front and I've used it constantly. So in my opinion, this is 100% worth the money and I would be putting this on my Christmas list for sure. The very last thing on my splurge list is slightly to the left field of sewing, but I feel like a lot of us sewers have a shared love for liberty in general. So I couldn't not include in this video the absolutely iconic Liberty Beauty Advent Calendar. I have wanted this advent calendar for years. It is the original Beauty advent calendar. It always comes looking like the Liberty store, which is absolutely gorgeous. It has loads of different boxes to open. I'm pretty sure you get 25 boxes on this one and the goodies are worth like way more than the £259. Obviously it's insanely expensive, I don't think I personally could ever justify spending £259 on that, but you know what, if money was no object or I had a seriously big budget that I've been given <laughs> to spend on my Christmas list, this would be what I would be asking for. So if you guys are feeling spenny this year, um, definitely take a look at this. If you do get it, I absolutely need to see pictures and live vicariously through you. So please send me a DM on Instagram. But I couldn't not finish this video with something slightly outrageous. 
but also gorgeous from Liberty. And that, my friends, is absolutely everything for the Crafty Pie Christmas gift guide this year. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video and find it useful. I've had so much fun scouring all of my favourite websites for gift ideas and I definitely think I will be adding a few of those bits to my Christmas list as well. Please make sure that if you liked this video you like it and leave a little comment. Don't forget to enter my giveaway as well by leaving your Instagram handle in the comments and as always I will try and leave links for everything mentioned in the description box if you do want to go ahead and make a purchase for yourself or for a friend or family member. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Mwah!